to analyze whether each of the ions are able to act as a bronzed lowry acid or bronzed lowry base. You need to analyze this separately for each ions. Okay, so let's take a look at Na plus first. What, uh, first of all, what does it mean by bronzed lowry acid and bronzed lowry base? Ah, by the way, I'm going to ask more questions on a rotational basis. I know that this class, you guys have a pretty high particip participation rate. I mean, most of you guys talk yep. more um, than it's the other activity. class. The other class is like one third of them are talking most of the time, but this class, I think more of you, um, like the majority of you do participate in the class uh, discussion. So uh, don't worry too much about you guys, but more for the other classes. And again, this counts under the ATL skills too. So you might want to uh, try to answer more questions, but if you're relatively quiet, I'm probably gonna make you talk more. And again, communication doesn't really just mean voicing out in lesson. I know that some of you are pretty shy. Uh, try to answer more questions, uh, even though if you don't want to, speak in class in front of everyone, at least type your answer out uh, in the chat so that you can let me, you, you, you can let me know that you are participating. Okay, so um, once, okay, you guys are uh, being distracted. So once it breaks down into ions, then we need to, ah, we were saying whether it can be a bronzed lowry acid and bronzed lowry base. What does bronzed lowry acid and base mean? Electron acceptor and why? Or you green bay? No, you're okay. Sure. Electron proton. Be proton donor and bronzed. Bronzed. Ah, my God, Louis. Never mind. Lou. Ah. John Chong, you're very good at good at the opposite. Okay. Okay, so um, yes, it's a bronze lowry acid is a proton donor, donor. and a bronze lowry base is a proton acceptor. So uh, other than the, the Lewis acid section that we have talked about at the very beginning of this uh, chapter, we have basically, uh, this whole chapter is almost exclusively defined based on bronze lowry acids and base. So make sure that you do know the under, uh, you do have a good understanding of what bronze lowry acids and base are. So um, if it is a proton donor or acceptor, so now take a look at Na+, can it be a proton donor? Can it be a proton donor? Uh, yes. Yes? How can it be a proton donor? What do you need to have in order to be a proton donor? Yo, proton. H plus. Uh. You need to have H plus. Do we have H plus in Na plus? No. 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 That means it can never be a proton donor. And um, what about bronze lowry base? Proton acceptor. Can it accept a proton? I don't think so. You don't think so. Okay. What kind of features do you think is required um, in order for, for a species to accept a proton? You've probably seen some in the SL stuff. Could it have an ion? It's an anion. Uh, what kind of features in the anion allows it to 